There they go. Uh, for those that need to know how to do this, I'm just going to give you a quick uh, rundown of how to set your MRT to full power. Um, okay, we're at the uh, left-hand side of the bike, and this area is where the the fuel panel would be. And what we do is we've got your ECU here, and you just unbolt that and move that out of the way, and you're going to find this. You see that there? It's got a yellow and green wire and then a black wire leading into it. And what you want to do is just separate those two. Like that. So they're now separated. Get a bit of electrical tape and just cover that up. And cover that up, just make it good. Now once you've done that, dead symbol now, move over to your airbox. Your airbox is under the seat. And you open that up and you're going to find your air filter, which is this thing here. And you take your air filter off, and behind your air filter you'll find this. That's your air blanking plate that restricts your air. It sits like that, and then sits in the airbox. You get that, and just chuck that away basically. All right, that's how you set them to full power. Uh, obviously, if you put another exhaust on like a DEP or something, you want to increase your, your main jet size, which is 122. So maybe go up to sort of a 12, a 124 or a 126. Uh, this is the, uh, the 180, 183 conversion one so it actually has a 128 in it but you don't quite need that much for uh, the 125s okay guys hope that helps